in this next activity of training video we're in PowerPoint and looking at inserting shapes but when we add shapes if we add in an oval it's just trying to keep it as a, a circle we're sort of guessing here the dimensions it may not be quite an exact circle so the trick is when we're inserting the shape let's go back to oval again just keep your finger on the shift key because what happens is when we stretch out that shape you can see it's perfectly in proportion it's even if I try and weave left and right with the mouse it's it stays as a circle and then just let go let's try that with the rectangle tool here again without the shift key it's oblongs rectangles pressing the shift key keeping that held down it's a perfect square all four sides stay in proportion stay the same size again that's useful for doing straight lines horizontal and vertical things like arrows so I can stretch an arrow out here but I'm not I'm just sort of guessing the position but you can see as soon as I hold the shift key down even if I'm quite way off with the mouse here it stays horizontal at some point it flicks to 45 degrees but without that shift key it's just anyone's guess with that held down I know I'm going to get a perfect horizontal line let's do the same for a vertical arrow shift key held down you know even if I'm this far off it it will go to 45 but I know it's perfectly vertical and then just let go so that shift key is a way of creating the shapes in conjunction with creating shapes it does give you a bit of control over the shape dimensions arrows whether they're perpendicular horizontal and vertical just something to keep in mind also when resizing the shapes now if I just have this square but I then just go to resize it I can easily lose that control again it's no longer square so I'm going to do control Z just to undo hold the shift key again do this from a corner handle as we call these things and you'll see that again it stays as a perfect square same with the circle shift key stretch it from a corner it stays as a perfect circle same with the arrow keys shift key make that smaller make this one bigger you know they're going to be spot on so there are some good techniques there just shape creation using that shift key I'll see you on the next training video.